So yes, now we are done with the face cleansing part. After refreshing my face, the first thing that I would love to do is drinking really good amount of warm water. It's not like hot water or it's not like cold water. I absolutely love drinking adequate amount of warm water to start off with the day. So that's what I'm going to do today. <sighs> Feeling little better temperature is little gloomy today i don't know why so yeah let's start off with the skincare part so first i'm going to start off with nourishing my lips for which i'm going to use this plum candy melts vegan lip balm in variant red love sorry red velvet love now you can see how much i used i absolutely love this lip balm it has got an amazing texture so yeah i also love this lineage sleeping lip mask it's also really really good but I'm done with the mask. I need to buy a new one. So meanwhile, I started using this plum lip balm and I absolutely, absolutely love it. And it's very, very affordable. Most of the time, it will be a really good deal in Amazon. So yeah, now I'm done with lip moisturization. Next, I'm going to start off with my skin for which I'm going to use this one. Now, this toner is from the brand One Thing and it is the Centella Asiatica Extract Toner. Look at the bottle, you guys. Look at the shade this toner is exactly like water so it's not going to be really heavy i know now it is summer season and most of us don't want to wear something that is little heavy summer we always prefer using this very lightweight water consistency toner and very lightweight gel like uh, moisturizer look at the glow so now I'm going to give a minute or two for this toner to settle down. Uh, meanwhile, I'm going to talk about uh, this toner. This toner is so good. You can see the amount of toner that I have used. I've been using this toner a lot lately and it's really, really lightweight. If you're a person who loves this really lightweight water-like toners, you can definitely, definitely try this one. But this one is a bit expensive. I think it retails for thousand something. But I bought this um, in buy one get one offer. So from this brand, I have this toner and the other toner as well. Now this one is the Centella Asiatica Extract and the other one is some cap release or something. Okay, I'll mention that in a separate video. So that is another extract. Um, so yeah. And one more thing to mention is this one is a Korean brand. Okay, next I'm going to apply a serum for which I'll be using this one. Now this one is the Cosrx Niacinamide Serum. Now this serum is my recent addiction. I absolutely, absolutely love this serum. Now this Niacinamide Serum is so damn effective, you guys. This serum works like magic for me. If I get this tinny bumps or acne on my skin, I used to wear this and Boom. within a day or two it just settles down so yeah this is something i absolutely absolutely love this packaging is really really cute i'm going to take very little amount of this niacinamide serum and then i'm going to apply it on my skin so what i do right i do this and then i pat it on my skin
there are a lot of niacinamide serums available in the market and uh, I have tried quite a few brands. Um, for me basically the Cosrx niacinamide serum, the one that I'm using now worked really well and apart from this, the minimalist one worked extremely extremely well on my skin but I find a lot of people talking about the uh, ordinary niacinamide serum but uh, Unfortunately, it didn't work that well on my skin. I don't know why. When compared to the ordinary niacinamide serum, the minimalist one worked extremely well for my skin. And also another important thing is like, do not use niacinamide serum on a daily basis, okay? Because, right, uh, putting a lot of active ingredients on your skin on a daily basis is not going to do you any favor. It's going to, you know, damage your skin barrier and that will cause a lot of trouble. So make sure that you put active ingredients like thrice a week because actives are very potent and they can give you instant results but down the lane there are a lot of chances for these active ingredients to damage your skin barrier so make sure you use very minimal quantity of the active ingredients and also stick to just thrice a week kind of uh, routine so now we're done with the serum part next i'm going to go in with the moisturizer so for moisturizer i'm going to use this one now this one is the dot and key watermelon moisturizer the summer is here and i always prefer wearing gel moisturizer during summer season so yeah now this one is a really really good moisturizer it has this really nice gel texture and when you apply it on your skin it gives this really nice cooling effect and it also gives a beautiful matte finish this one is going to nourish your face and hydrate your face really well without making it look super oily or something like that so i'm going to take a really good quantity of this moisturizer and then i'm going to apply it on my skin now you'll be able to see the beautiful effect So yes, now we are done with the face moisturization. Now you can see the glow has gone because this particular moisturizer right from Dot and Key, it is a matte moisturizer but then it is in gel consistency. I absolutely, absolutely love. So if you're someone who's looking for a really nice lightweight gel consistency moisturizer but then you don't want to have all this glow on your skin during the summer season, then I would highly, highly recommend you to try this one. So yes, now we are done with face moisturization. Next, I'm going to do sunscreen for which i'll be using this dot and key sunscreen now this one is the watermelon variant so yeah now this one is a watermelon cooling sunscreen so again this is also the watermelon range i don't know why but i'm so much addicted to this watermelon range of tartar key first i have used this watermelon moisturizer and i absolutely absolutely loved it so what i did i went ahead and bought the face wash and it was working really well and finally i thought of buying this sunscreen and it's so damn good there is no white cast no heavy feel and the other big advantage is that it gives you this really nice cooling sensation on top of your skin so that is something i absolutely love when it comes to this particular uh, sunscreen and it has got spf 50 pa triple plus in it so very good sun protection i'm going to use this two finger rule and i'm going to apply the sunscreen so yeah i have taken the sunscreen you see that so hope you're able to see there is no white cast like zero white cast uh, there are a lot of sunscreens available in the market because most of the sunscreens are marketed in a way saying that it will give zero white cast or no heavy feel and all but but very few sunscreen when you apply on your skin initially it will give this slight white cast and over the period of time like within two to three minutes it settles down the white cast level settles down but this one to my surprise there is no white cast right from the starting of the application so yeah and this one is really really lightweight gives you a nice cooling effect on your skin settles down on top of your skin without feeling very heavy
I mean, it's very, very lightweight. Summer is on, you need really high sun protection. And this one have SPF 50 PA++ in it. So yeah, definitely, definitely give this a shot. To be more specific, oily skin beauties, you can definitely give this a shot. So yes, we are done with the skincare and my skin is all good now. So tell me what are the skincare things that you use to keep your skin in a really good state. Do your skincare routine on a daily basis to have this really nice healthy skin. Like four to five years back, I had really bad problematic skin and I have tried a lot of products, but then most of them did work really well for me. So I tried a lot of products, but then I don't know how to choose products effectively to sort my skin issues but now i'm little better i have a little bit of understanding and i know how which product i should use to sort a particular type of issue on my skin and yeah i'm able to see a lot of changes in my skin as well so yes do incorporate a proper skincare routine understand your skin type talk with the dermat because we people right we see a lot of things in internet and um, you know a lot of things are favorite influencer wearing on their skin and it works like magic for them but then when we apply the same product we're not going to see the same result so if you're having a lot of skin issues i would highly recommend you to check with your dermat and the other thing is like stick on to a very basic skincare routine see everyone doesn't need this active ingredients so you should know which active ingredient will work for what type of skin concern and then use those things so that is very very important don't go and buy whatever is available in the market because end of the day if you're trying too many products without being consistent nothing is going to happen to your skin you will eventually damage your skin barrier so choose your products wisely and stick on to them more than all these things hydrate your body really really well so yes this is my recent skincare like my summer skincare routine that is something i want to talk about in this day hope you guys really enjoyed watching this content if you really like it please give a thumbs up if you have not subscribed to this channel please take a moment to subscribe and also if you're not following me on my instagram page then this is my insta handle do check out my instagram page and follow me there as well so next time with another amazing content i'll be to you guys and let's buy from tfl